Hi, and welcome back to the Mr. Fred Warden Show. And tonight here I have two, two firsts in one. A little bit of a spooky challenge. I have baked super hot pig skins. And they only just have um, Carolina Reaper, Trinidad Mariga Scorpion, Seven Pop Range Strain Peppers, and Ghost Peppers only. So, I mean, it shouldn't be that bad. Just kidding. <laughs> it's got four of the hottest peppers in the world in there. So, they are made hot. They're made by Blazing Foods and DeathNuts.com. And then they added a nice little side in here, which I've never tried before either. It is Carolina Reaper Blood. So, it's going to be. Some super hot pork skins with the hottest peppers in the world with a side of Carolina Reaper blood. Oh, and by the way, people watching at home, my camera person randomly has hiccups tonight. So if the camera's moving or you hear something in the background, it just might so happen to be that. So, um, so I'm going to try these out. Um, little man of fire kind of intrigued a little bit, but I'm not sure these might be out of his league. So here's my side pack of the Carolina Reaper blood, but let's just try one of these first, just to see, just to see how it is on its own. I'll pick one right off the top. So this is a pig skin, dried pig skin flavoring, and those delicious hot peppers in there. So I'll try one, let you know how this goes. So this is not a challenge. I got a close. I already inhaled some of that powdery. Hot stuff already. Getting in my sinuses a little bit. But here we go. Woo! Mm hmm. It's definitely a pork skin. And it is. <coughs> it is hot. It is very hot, people. And. The powder's floating around. Oh, this always gets me a little bit. A lot of these powdery things these days. <coughs> it does taste like a pork skin. Um, if you have them before as a snack. But you can clearly taste the pepper in there too. As well. And the burn kicks in pretty quick. Um, right now, I'd say probably about an eight or nine on the average person scale. Chili head, maybe like a three, but it's kind of building on me a little bit here, so it might get to maybe like a four or so. Um, okay, so what I'm going to do now, um, now that I got that, and try some of the Carolina Reaper blood and pour out a little bit. Oh. Oh. It doesn't look as red as I thought it would be. Looks like your standard hot, hot sauce, that dark reddish, brownish color. So let's double dutch on this and see what kind of heat level we get. Oh, I think I got a sneeze coming. It's my nose still. Here we go, oh, Reaper blood. <laughs> Spooky. Woo. I don't know if that's a chip or the Reaper blood or a combination, but definitely got some going there. Let's try a little bit more. Oh, keep getting it up in the sinuses. I mean, these are hot. These have Reaper in them already and some of the house peppers. The Reaper blood amped it up a little bit. 
say we're probably hanging at, at about now about a nine to ten for an average person and probably like about a four for a chili head. So I mean not suffering super bad, but I mean there's a pretty hard burn now. Um little man of fire. Unfortunately I don't think these are for you and most of you at home unless you like a really hot snack. I mean I can handle it. I probably want one down tons and tons of these. But Let's do one more. I mean, the flavor's not too bad. I mean, you got that pepper flavor, but um, it's not too bad. He's Reaper blood for a hot sauce. Um, I thought it might be more reaper -y, but I mean, it's reaper -y, don't get me wrong, but it's uh, kind of like a hot sauce. All right, here we go. One more. Chip for the evening and some reaper blood some more. <clears throat> a little bit. I'll have to save these to snack on later, both of these, but because I don't want to bore you eating too many. But obviously, a bag of these. If you ate a bag of these at once, you'd be pretty, pretty fried, I think. But <coughs> I think with some of these spicy challenges, what gets me the most is that powdery kind of floating in your sinuses. Kind of gets me a little bit. <coughs> but yeah, it's hot. Um, definitely probably not a snack for your chili head. Again, um, there's Carolina Reaper, Trinidad Scorpion in there, um, Seven Pop Rain Strain, and Ghost Pepper. And then the Carolina Reaper blood is um, pretty much really... Carolina Reaper mash or, or the mash version of it. So, I mean, it's pretty much straight Reaper. Um, so, again, it's very hot. Um, again, this product, again, before I finish up, by Blazing Foods, DeathNuts.com. You can find it there. Um, and it's hot. I mean, if they want to do, they could probably make some kind of challenge all this or eat so much. Um, it's not an official challenge at this point, but it's hot and it's right along the lines of probably one of the easier challenges. I mean, if you would put both of them together. So, again, this is one that's pretty good. Pretty good heat. Uh, pretty good. Would be good for a challenge. Uh, but anyway, uh, subscribe if you haven't yet and you're watching out there. Like this. Um, we're getting close to the 100. We got the 100 in the um, League of Fire. We got made 100 points. Still need to get 100 videos and 100 subscribers yet. So you could be one of those if you are out there and you haven't subscribed yet. So anyway, stay tuned for some other interesting and fun videos coming up. And we'll see you next time on the Mr. Breadwarden Show.